everyone watching knows that the cost of living is going up astronomically. And unless you work for the government, you're not getting an increase. So it's very, very tough. Jay Goldberg is with the Canadian Taxpayers Federation joining me right now because I want to ask you, that when the ministers say, you know, well, it's none of our doing because it's the Ukraine or it's world forces, is that the truth? Or are there other reasons why in Canada everything's going <laughs> skyrocketing? It's not at all the truth. The Trudeau government has single-handedly doubled our national debt. Uh, we went from so about $600 billion. Well, what that matters is they've been spending tens and hundreds of billions of dollars, which means the Bank of Canada has to print hundreds of billions of dollars. And when you have more money chasing the same amount of goods, prices go up. So That's Justin economics. Turner, he's saying, oh, that was COVID. It won't happen again. Look, no other country doubled their national debt to deal with COVID. That's the Thank reality. You. Thank you. And the spending is still going on post-COVID. The spending is still going on. And I think it's time we recognize that the government is actually enjoying inflation to some extent because government revenue is up tens of billions of dollars compared to what they expected it to be before. So in some ways, this inflation is causing prices to go up. People are paying more in sales tax and other taxes as well. The government is raking it in and they are increasing government revenue tens of billions of dollars. And that comes out of your pocket, my pocket, and every other taxpayer. So part of it is the carbon tax, which is going up again, uh, higher than the rate of inflation. Uh, you know, part of it is, is paying the money for uh, the debt. Is part of it also the giveaways that government's doing? They say, oh, well, we're helping everybody by giving you these checks every month. Well, they're not helping anyone by giving checks. First of all, that money is no, taken from- they're helping their vote, so. <laughs> that money is taken from taxpayers' pockets to begin with. That's why we have to think about it. This is literally out of one taxpayer's pocket and into another. And in some cases, the government just running around telling you, you know, this is somehow a gift. The reality is it comes out of your pockets. And if it's not, and if it's funded by the deficit, it comes out of your children and grandchildren's pockets. But we know that in the coming election, whenever it is, the Liberals are going to say, do not believe those guys when they say we have to cut the debt because they'll cut services to you. We're going to cut services to you. The Public Service Alliance is going to say, you know what, cut this or cut our numbers and you're going to have fewer services. You know, if we simply return to government spending levels from two, three, four years ago, we would have a huge federal surplus and you wouldn't have a debt problem. This is not slash and burn. We actually have a clear pathway to get back to sustainability. The government's just choosing not to take it. Well, I mean, it was uh, David Dodge, a former governor and uh, a high-profile deputy minister, who said the other day that even with the projected deficits, it's going to be higher because they do that every year. It's going to be million higher. Million, Sixty. They do it every year. It's going to be higher, and all of these interest rate hikes are greatly affecting the amount of money that we have to pay, and so the federal deficit is only going to explode. So, if you want to save some money, complain to your MP. Complain to your MP and make sure they get their house in order. Jay Goldberg, thanks very much. Three minutes. The Trudeau subsidized media cannot engage you in the discussion. They can't even present the discussions that we do here in this channel, which are critical to the health and future of Canada. So to help us keep broadcasting, please contribute financially. The address is below. You can write a check, PayPal, and please subscribe.